of Larry Woodruff, one of two men charged with capital murder in the death of Jasmine Barnes. Today, he made his first court appearance in the case, and his attorney expressed concern that he will not get a fair trial in Houston. Investigator Robert Arnold is live downtown at the courthouse with the update. Robert? As you say, this was Larry Woodruff's first appearance before a judge since being charged with capital murder, and his defense attorney came out swinging. So it's not over when someone is arrested. There's still a long way to go. Lisa Andrews was appointed to represent Larry Woodruff. She says her client denied any involvement in Jasmine Barnes' murder. He denied any involvement to police officers when they picked him up. Andrews also took issue with statements made about her client's gang affiliation and guilt by everyone, from the governor to the head of the Houston Police Officers Union. They need to let the process play out um, and, and quit with the incendiary language. In fact, Andrews already filed a motion for a change of venue, concerned potential jurors are already biased against her client. Head of the police union, Joe Gamaldi, was unfazed. If I were his lawyer, I'd be doing everything I could to distract from the fact that he's a complete dirtbag who's got a lengthy criminal history. He's a documented gang member. Prosecutor Tom Berg says he's not concerned about jury bias, especially since a trial would be months, if not more than a year away. Different people will remember different things. Some people will remember nothing about it. And surprisingly, as we get jury panels in, some people won't know about the case. And KPRC legal analyst Brian Weiss adds getting a change of venue is not about whether potential jurors have heard of this case, but... It's whether they formed an opinion about the defendant's guilt or innocence that they can't set aside. Andrew says she will wait to see what other public statements are made before deciding whether to push the issue of a change of venue with the court. She also addressed the other man charged in this case implicating her client, what she had to say about that, as well as what the sheriff had to say about the case involving Woodruff coming up at 6 o'clock. Reporting live from the Harris County Criminal Courthouse in downtown, Robert Arnold, KBRC, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Robert.